Hi, I'm Lou. Welcome to my Lou Tube. I've just got through half term, which is always a little bit of a struggle during school holidays because there's a lot to juggle with boys, work and training. And last week, training took a bit of a back seat, but I'm okay with that. I think since my injury, my priorities have switched around and I'm not actually training for anything specific. So when I need to suffer in a session, I sometimes find it hard to do. And last week, I was halfway through a swift session and I just could not be asked. I didn't even feel that bad about bending it. Next day, I took a rest day. The day after that, I was out on my bike and I was absolutely fine. So sometimes it's okay to just call it when you're not feeling it. Anyway, I don't know where the English summer has gone. It was here for a bit. It seems to have disappeared. I think it's time for a change of scenery. Although this is lovely. I'm in the woods near where I live. It's where Batman was filmed. It's pretty cool. But yeah, I think it's time for a change. So stay tuned. Howdy. I'm back in Texas. I've not been here since November when Rob and I were here when Justin and Francis was staying with Rob's parents. So it's pretty cool to be back because last time I was here, I was on crutches. I'm now back on my bike and I've forgotten how sweet my bike is that's at Rob's parents' house. So I'll stop in a sec because I've nearly finished my training. I'll talk you through my bike and tell you about something pretty ridiculous that happened to me on the aeroplane yesterday. Training done. I did an hour in the neighborhood. I managed to do over 20 miles because it's completely flat, maybe five foot of climbing total in an hour, which is pretty bonkers, but oh my gosh, the sun is lovely. I think I'm solar powered. It is just so nice to be back in the heat again. It's not too ridiculous. I think the next few days, the temperature's gonna go up to mid thirties and stuff like that. It's humid, it always is in Houston, but it is lovely to be back. So yesterday on the flight, I had an interesting experience with my water bottle. I'd filled it before I got on the plane and made the mistake about halfway through the flight of taking a sip, but I opened it like this into my mouth. It exploded and it was a little bit embarrassing because <laughs> water kind of went everywhere, including on the float next to me. <laughs> You'd think I'd never flown before, but I'd never made that mistake before. I don't know, I must have filled it too much or whatever, but Oh, there's a deer. Can you see that? Hello. Hi. I don't think that's normal for them to come out in the middle of the day like that. I think they normally come out pretty early in the morning, but there we are. Hope it doesn't run into the road. Anywho, I'm here for nearly a week. I've got um, my International's Zwift ride to lead tomorrow. So I've got to dig out my turbo. I do have one here. Um, so I will show you my turbo setup. Oh, I also need to show you my bike. So I am very lucky to have a bike here at Rob's parents' house. It used to be at his house up in Dallas, but he doesn't have that house anymore. I sold it when he moved over to live with me. So my bike came down here to Houston which is just handy, so I don't need to bring one every time I come. I haven't done a bike check, I don't think, of my bikes at home, um, but you'll know that they're pink. This bike is not pink, but it is a Bianchi. It's rather nice. So it's a uh, Bianchi Ultra XR4. The wheels are sweet Envy wheels that I've had a few years now. They used to be on my other bike, but I delaminated the back wheel by braking way too much one time when I was doing, I think it was the Etap or something in France. Oh, this bike was hooked up by Ben for me when he put on one of those oversized pulley wheels as well, which is super cool. So yes, this is a very, very nice bike, which is kind of ridiculous that I only get to ride it a couple of times a year, but it's fast and it's fun. It's not pink, but it's the next best thing because it's still a sweet bike. <laughs> so we also are going to have some fun with a golf buggy. Rob's parents have got one that has been souped up. So I think it goes 
quite fast. I think Rob's gonna try and race me on my bike. So we will bring you some action when we do that. But for now, it's lunchtime. I need some Tex-Mex, so I will talk to you tomorrow. Howdy, so I'm about to leave the International Drive. My turbo setup is pretty awesome, and a view of what I will be firing myself into as soon as the ride finishes. So hopefully some of you might join me on Zwift. We've got a couple more of these International rides before we take a break for the summer. I've got a ride to leave, so let's go. Ride done, and now some relaxation. Sorry if the waterfall makes you need the toilet. Uh oh, what's gonna happen here? <laughs> I think I should go and do that now. <laughs> Tomorrow I'll bring you some action with Rob in the golf cart while I'm on my bike. But for now, more of this. We got golf buggy pacing. proof of the fact that everything is bigger in Texas. Check this out. This is someone's house. One family's house that they're building. Looks like a village. That is a house. So that's me training done. Almost an hour. Burnt all my matches. Rob and I are heading into downtown Houston tonight to go to a piano bar and I'm going to be wearing my cowboy boots, so wish me luck. Well, good news everybody. I survived the night out in cowboy boots. Yeehaw! Had a great time. Now back, Rob's parents' house, doing a bit of training. It is Hot, 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 hot. Whew. Oh my, that's a snake. Hang on. Can you see that? Ooh. Snake roadkill. Not normal. <laughs> Not where I'm from anyway. <laughs> so, I'm cooked. I'm about to go and fire myself into the swimming pool and chill for the rest of the day. I'll fly home tomorrow. Week's gone fast. So that's it from me for now, but I will talk to you soon because I do need to tell you about my summer plans. I hope you're all keeping really, really well. I hope you're able to get outside, fresh air, sunshine if you have it. Thank you for the comments, the likes, and for subscribing. See you soon.